Hey everyone, this is Vikas for Skyline Motions and in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to create this type of text behind any character or behind any object. So let's have a look and get started. Alright, so we have two composition here F1 and F2. So the first one is very easy to create but this is not applicable for all type of videos. But the second one is applicable for all type of videos. So let's create this one first. So go to file menu and click on new and take a new composition and close this uh, previous composition. Okay, now go to file menu again and click on preferences and here is frame format. So this composition is 1920 into 1080 and 30 frame per second. So it's good for now and click on save. Okay, now let's import a footage. So go to folder and uh, this is our footage. You can download this footage from pixabay.com and I have given a link in the description. So download this and drag and drop to the flow window. Okay, now drag this uh, footage to the viewer and click on this fit button and click on this window layout one for single view and increase the size of this uh, preview window. Okay, now right click on this flow window and go to arrange tool and check this box to turn on the grid snap and uh, Set this uh, composition 300 frame long. So put the value 300, which is equal to 10 second and hit enter. Okay, now we have to create a text. So click on this text plus button and add a text node and type a text, whatever you want to type. So I'm typing fight and let's merge this text with this footage. So click on this merge button and add a merge node and connect this yellow point to this footage and green point to this text and drag this merge one to the viewer okay now select this text and increase the size of this okay now turn on this high quality button and turn off this auto proxy okay now go to tool menu and go to matte option and here is luma keyer so click on this and take a luma keyer node and place it over here and connect the output of this footage to this luma here and drag this luma here to the viewer and double click on this luma here and go to properties and here is invert option so check this box okay and now set this matte contrast something like uh, one and set this matte gamma to zero okay now take a merge node again so click on this merge button and add a merge node and connect this yellow point to this uh, merge one and green point to this luma keyer and drag this merge two to the viewer okay and now let's play this okay so it's looking something like that now select this text and increase the size of this little bit okay now we have to create an aspect ratio so click on this uh, bg button and add a background node and rename it to black and hit enter okay now select this black and click on this rectangle mask and add a rectangle mask and set this mask something like uh, something like that and let's merge this so place it over here and take a merge node so click on this merge button and add a merge node and connect this yellow point to this merge 2 and green point to this black and drag this merge 3 to the viewer and select this rectangle and click on this invert option Okay, so it's looking something like that. Now this is this one is the final node. So right click on this and rename it to final. Okay, so it's done. Now let's check this. Okay, so it's looking awesome. And now I will show you second method. So take a new composition. Okay. Now import second footage. So this is our footage. You can download this also from pixabay.com and a link given in the description. So download this and drag and drop to the flow window. Okay, and drag this to the viewer and click on this fit button and click on this window layout one for single view and increase the size of this uh, preview window and right click on this flow window and go to arrange tool and check this box to turn on the grid snap. Okay, now set this composition from frame number 400 to 620 so put the value 400 okay and put the value 6 
टू फाइव अप्रॉक्स सो लेट्स प्ले दिस ओके ओके एज यू कैन सी दिस फुटेज इज समथिंग सेकी सो लेट्स ट्रैक इट फर्स्ट सो सेलेक्ट दिस and go to tool menu and here is tracking option and here is tracker so click on this and add a tracker node and drag this tracker to the viewer and here is a tracker one so click on this add button and add a second tracker and set this tracker over here okay now set this second tracker okay okay now let's analyze this so click on this button here and okay render completed okay okay now let's create a text so click on this text plus button and add a text node and type a text whatever you want to type but i'm typing amazing and let's connect this green point to this text and drag this tracker to the viewer and double click on this tracker and here is a tracker options so click on this best match go to this uh, operators operation tab and click on this match move button and click on this foreground over background okay and set this text something like uh, something like this and paste it over here click on this high quality button and turn off this auto proxy and set this text on ground something like okay now let's play this okay now go to frame number 580 and select this text and click on this uh, polyline mask and add a polygon tool and let's zoom it by pressing control and a scroll up and create a rough mask around this car something like this okay it's done and click on this invert option okay so it's looking something like that now go to frame number 590 and select this mask and drag it over here okay go to frame number 600 and drag this mask over here Okay now go to frame 580 again and move this CTI on frame number 570 and set this something like that and Okay now go to frame number 560 select all these control points and drag it something like this now go to 550 and okay okay now it's done so let's play this
all right so it's looking awesome and that's all for this tutorial i hope you like it so i will see you next tutorial till then bye bye